hi welcome again today we are going to uh, see what all uh, things we can do into we look up and a uh, county function this example will explain all the nitty gritties and how exactly you want to use it the we look up and count function into it here uh, we are having uh, one uh, excel sheet and this excel sheet contains the detail of student id and the status of whether they are registered or not now these two columns are available with us and this is a second sheet which we are having this contains the student id and the attendance i mean i will just hide it the student id and attendance now what i need to find is these two list what are the commonities in these two list i mean those who have all who was present for the uh, today's session were registered earlier or not or the vice versa or the students who were registered how many of them were present so we might find some case who were registered but not present and might also find some cases who were present but not registered so in order to find this what we are going to do is in this sheet where we have a registered uh, detail what we will do we will put a vlookup lookup over here stating to find whether these registered student were present or not how we can present it for finding this this is the column we will search this particular uh, uh, student id he here in this student id if this matches we will take this column so we will just get whether they are present or not okay now see is equal to v l double o k v look up or to be making to make it more uh, easy for you to understand we will go to formula we will say insert function we will click on v look up and we will say look up value look up value is this then table array where we need to find so we need to find in the second sheet I will be selecting the top left till bottom right all field selected now column index number which column I have to pick when the volume when it matches so I need to pick if you remember it was D so B C D it is third column it is C B we are searching D we are picking so B C D is a third column column index number is 3 and range lookup it should be false as always because we want an exact match and here on this table array we will just make it fix why because it is to be same while we copy now this is which we have got this student was absent now I will just copy it from top to bottom thereby ensuring uh, that all values are displayed now see we have got present absent present absent and all present 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 present, present. see it will show NA in case this, the, that particular uh, student is not present so in order to make this more uh, understandable what we can do is here at NA what I will add I can add uh, there, there is a, something called error so I, I will add that error uh, condition later on first let us understand this so now this we have already got status status one no. now the vice versa now let us see in the second column does those who are present how many of you are registered registration status S T A T U S. for this again we will be clicking on insert function we look up sorry 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 that made a mistake insert function we will go to bb lookup and uh, on lookup value we need to find this table array this time the table array will be the next sheet which we are having this next sheet again we will be selecting uh, this from B and C we need to pick C that is the second column you remember you must remember column index number is the second column we want to tick lookup value is again will be false why because we want exact match done C is coming registered one thing which I have not done is I have not fixed this by pressing F4 I have fixed it now I've got the detail that how oh, oh sorry I 
I just copied talent, so I got, so I should get a value. Done. Now this is in front of us. These were not registered. That was registered and all. So we have got the detail. Now we are having this clarity that those students who were present, how many of them, uh, who of them are, we were registered. And on the sheet, we were having that uh, those who were registered, how many of them are present. So that means in this sheet, in the present sheet, these students will not be there who were registered but not present. So what I can do is I can just cut, copy, paste these values and then I will find exactly what will be the total uh, number of student where there yes you need to see that there is one absent case 303178 like 303178 I just find will find 303178 is here it is here an absent okay done so I will again go to my registration sheet and here I will go and pick all those columns which were not there so I will just pick it up I just picked up control C I went into my admission section admission sheet and I said right click paste special I will do I'm doing a paste special why because I was I have also copied some formula and I will do paste special values so I'm more interested into values which are there rather than the formula itself now this is here now this NA I will just copy and paste in the next row so we got it now these are all student who were registered but not no these are all registered so what I will do is I will just specify REGIS registered on this these are all registered but somehow absent and these are all absent A B S E N T I can write it down if I want done I will just cut copy paste and I will do this calculation for the entire lot now see going bottom this is the total number of students that was registered now we've got a detail now let us see how we can use county function we'll just ensure that our first cell is free so that we it is visible every time data sorry view view freeze panes freeze panes so this first will be available So we went at the bottom and here we are specifying county function. We'll see total so T O T A L T O T A L total is I don't know, symbol 113. Done. Then uh, present I mean uh, registered R E G I S T E R E D registered. I will say equal to C O U N T bus count F the range where the registered state is, is here is here so I will just select from top to bottom top to bottom comma find out R E G I S T E R E registered see county function works like you need to specify two things one what what is the range where you need to find the things and second column second uh, argument has what is to be found that that too will do the work now this specifies that this uh, registered total registered was 82 now if I say present P R E S E N T, how many present were there so this I will make it more easy for you to understand rather than freezing the value what I will say is you take a value from here because this column contains the same value which we were putting in double quotes that's more easy for us why because I can copy it uh, from that uh, location to another and uh, but I need to change this because when I will copy this I need to change because my counting of uh, present and absent is in section is in column D so rather than D2 I will say just do this and D1 to D100 see it, it, it is changing there's a problem with that so total present where 81 now we will find registered and present registered and present P -R -E -S -E -N -T. now that is a complex kind of calculation that we need to do we need to have two conditions registered and present so we will click here 
and say equal to c o u n t count if s now there is a function count if s which have more which can have more than one argument so on count if s i first thing i will say criteria range so first criteria range is this registered so i'm just choosing from top to bottom i will go here and what they need to find you need to find here is that it should be registered r e g i s t e r e d register then i will say a comma you will ask me what will the second criteria range so my second criteria range is this that is uh, attendance so i will select the entire attendance slot and then again i will go and say in this column you find present p r e s e n t close it bracket close done this is here in front of you total aspirant who were registered and are present are 30 so now i can find attendance a w t e n d e n c attend are uh, absent from registered absent from registered absent from registered this is equal to registered this much 82 and present this much so 32 is a absent cases from registration present from non registered p r is present from non registered present from non registered that we can have a value anything a value of i will do some uh, fabrication work which will make it more visible okay present from non registered will be those guys who are new so this is equal to total present this much 81 and uh, registered and present was 30 so 31 was the case which who 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 are present and they are not registered so th this is how count if function works so you need to take count if into consideration and it uh, takes a value and it gives you the value depending upon the logic you specify so we will again uh, see this it takes these all values and so in count count if you need to specify two things first where you need to which column needs to be counted and what is the condition on which counted in count if s you need to have more than one condition i mean first column then what is to be found in that column then again a second column range and what is to be found in that, that column range you can extend it to any number of conditions i mean 3 4 5 6 or so on so this was all for v lookup and count if and count fs see you soon till then take care